Hey guys, welcome back into more Prey. I am in love with this game so far. So last episode, or just the first episode, pretty wild actually. Let me make sure that I move stuff. Okay. How am I doing on my neuro mods? Um, is there a neuro mod for inventory space? Because I see that I can have more inventory space. Suit modification skill increases. Yeah, okay. Oh, I think I see it. Yeah, let's go with this. Okay, we get more space. The first episode was pretty wild. And we're gonna do a leverage. Uh, I found out that we've been living in Groundhog Day because our brother may have been taking advantage of us. Scanning I'm still- no type and material detected. Oh, hi. Oh, I, I understand how combat works, game. I whack things with wrench. I good at combat. I use blunt force. But I am gonna bring this turret with me. Um, our brother may have been taking advantage of us, but I'm not completely sure about that. Essentially, we as Morgan agreed to take part in some experiment that I don't really understand. I think it has to do with what the... What the Morgan recording told us, at which Transstar had started making neuromods from Titans. And for some reason, we might have been taking part. Ah, get him, turret. Get him. Get him, turret. I'll get this one. You get that one. You loser. Why would you pretend to be a plant? Come here, little mimic. Come here. Die, mimic, die. Okay. So yeah, it seems like based off the information that we've been getting, Morgan willingly agreed to be experimented on and may have even willingly agreed to extend the testing, but I don't know if that technically involved what was going on, which was we'd go through the test and then the neuro mods that we had installed, where's the body, would be removed, which would remove our memory, and it just kept happening in a constant cycle like that. I don't know if we agreed to that bit. Because according to the Morgan recording, there was supposed to- Oh no, they broke him! You bastards! You broke him. I don't know if I gave you a name. We'll name you in a second. I, it needs to come naturally. It's not something I can think about. I see a gun. You look weird. Ah! Where? Where? Don't wave at me, you little weirdo. So yeah. Uh, our brother Alex stopped us from looking at the recording that we had sent ourselves, which involved- Ooh, silence pistol ammo, thank you. Stopped us from looking at the recording which we made for ourselves, And we had to go to, I believe, Dr. Calvino's office, because apparently he has a reset that will allow us to watch the video. One of you's not right. Odd. Okay. You win this round, Mimic. You win this round. Okay, Elias. Oh, you're the guy from security. I'm sorry, Elias. Okay. Also, there's other places here in this lobby area that I really want to check out. I don't think I checked out things on the other side. Let's go. Ooh, we can do... Let's go this way. But yeah, there's other places in the main office that I really want to check out. And we have to go back to the first area. Oh, Yuri! You have unlicensed neuromods. And guess who's gonna have them? Me! Okay, okay, Yuri's doing something. Yuri, leave me alone. Bad Yuri. Bad Yuri! Take that, Yuri. I'm sure you were a nice person. Transstar Life Employee Profile. 
In this edition of Transstar Life's Rising Star segment, we profile Harley Granger, a member of the Neuromod sales team who currently stationed aboard Talos One. Some of you might recognize Harley's name from his professional baseball days, when he played second base in War Number 66 for the Tornadoes. Harley was assigned to Talos One two years ago and has made the journey into orbit and back 50 times. Not bad for someone who's afraid of flying. My time playing baseball forced me to deal with that fear. Believe it or not, shuttle flight to Talos One is easier than a cross-country liner trip. I can see that, actually. Okay, any mimics in here? You you two look natural. Why are there so many scuff marks on the floor? Do you guys not take care of this building? This is a very expensive building. It's a space station. It's not even a building. Oh, can't look in here. Okay. Ooh, Yuri's office. Where are those unnumbered neuromods at? Ah, these are mine now. Thank you, Yuri. Okay, um, hacking would be nice to go up to hacking too. Repair would be nice. You can fix broken turrets, operators, that would be great. Um, allows weapon upgrade kits, upgrade. Ooh, we also would look like that. Uh, I'm kind of feeling the repairs. Let's go with repair. Sales folder. Uh, too many side effects from what I gathered. It's like a pinprick near the eye, right? I mean, it looks scary, but I think we can get advertising to push some more appealing pros of neuro mods. We can shift public attention from that. I'm not too worried about the red eye stuff either. I don't think any one person in the public sector is going to manage to get their hands on that many neuro mods at one time. Not at these prices. What I find far more worrying, though, are the reports of memory loss during neuro mod removal. I mean, amnesia seriously. We can rewire a person's brain and give them any skill we want, but we can't avoid resetting their head back to the moment where they got the shit installed if we decide to take it out. If this leaks, it'll kill the neuromod sales. Doesn't matter if you need specialized equipment or training to take one out. No one wants to risk losing years of their life for the ability to speak French. This can't even go in the fine print. As far as the customer is concerned, neuromods are permanent. Yeah, that sounds like something corporate would do. Elias to Yuri... You can't ship it home. It's already been noticed. One month pay makes it go away. Oh, Elias, you were blackmailing people. You loser. Well, then again, Yuri did have unnumbered neuromods, but also... Oh, hello. Respect. Respect. You caught me while I was off guard. I was rambling. Nice one. Proud of you, buddy. Okay. Ooh, what's this? What is it? Huntress Boltcaster launches foam darts which do zero damage, also known for the ability to annoy co-workers, distract enemies, and remotely trigger buttons and screens. Well, the remotely trigger buttons and screens sounds interesting. Okay, we've read the application instructions before. There's a very large chance that this isn't gonna work. I wanna try to go back to that office and trauma and see if I can't let myself in using the bolt caster. You know what, let's check the lobby a little bit more. Chances are we're gonna have to come back through this exact area anyway. Oh, I can fix you now. Oh, look at you, good as new. Okay. Ooh, I don't think this will work. Music got weird for a second. Oh, mm, probably not. Okay, because... Ooh, he's got mail. But no... No button to press to possibly open. No applications is what I'm trying to say. Okay. Well, that was a dead. That was dead. Okay. Back up. Back up. I want to get a little bit into the story before I... Good morning, Talos. Sometimes you freak me out. Should report to their workstation for the day. Before I really start to backtrack, because I really need more neuromods in order to do certain things. Oh. Someone tried to block that off. Oh. A 
Oh, it's a bolt. I'll take it. It's mine now. This is also mine. Oh, it's malfunctioned. I can fix it, but I don't want to waste my spare parts because I literally have a fabricator in my office down the hall. So that's kind of dumb. Okay. We need to go into hardware labs. We need to find Calvino's office and we need to figure out how we're going to turn back on. Uh, I think they called it a looking glass. That way we can watch the tape from ourselves. I don't know. We've been told that we can trust January because from my understanding, January is literally just comprised of uh, things that the other Morgan before the removal of the Neuromod wanted to tell us. But also we've gotten several notes from people that Morgan wasn't exactly acting right. Like Morgan wasn't acting like, ah, okay. Freaking space station keeps falling apart. Corrupted. Interesting. Okay, so they can corrupt people's minds and technology. I want to know more about the Typhon. Okay, I'm gonna check this area clearly once I'm sure I'm safe. Is that a neuromod? That is a neuromod. Oh, I don't even have to break it open. I'm hearing things, I just don't know where I'm hearing them from. Oh, okay, that kind of freaked me out for a second. Oh, there goes a person. There goes a person. We also know that people are alive, but they're in cargo, I think. Uh, Johnson's term came to an end, paving the way for President Reagan. Even then, the space race was showing signs of faltering, eager push from previous decades being dulled by the lack of advancement that space had seemed to promise. Soviet Union had already suffered economic collapse through similar space focus. Many in Washington and the Pentagon found further spending on space program unpopular, giving rise to a wave of politicians, many whom had successfully prevented U.S. involvement in Vietnam. Oh, many whom, okay, successfully prevented the U.S. involvement in Vietnam that focused on solving problems at home. Okay, so in this, Reagan lived for a very long time, was not assassinated, and the U.S. did not get involved in Vietnam. Also, why am I getting water? Does this help me in any way? I have no idea. But very cool. I like that they're playing around with history a little bit. It makes things a bit more interesting to try to figure out. Thank you, Hope. Um, oh, let's read some mail. You're my only hope. Oh, okay. Hey, I sent Larson to Demo Theater to see if he can sneak a bottle of Old Sarder. Join us. Demo delay. Hope, just a heads up that the Artax propulsion system demo will have to be delayed. We're still working on a slight calibration issue in the machine shop. It's nothing to worry about, Franklin. Okay. I can hear something. Ah, okay. There's a phantom somewhere. Ooh, I can probably glue myself up to the upper floor. Let's see. Yeah, because I can't hack that. Okay. Uh, let's go this way and see if we can't find a key code. All right. Ooh. Oh, okay. I see you. You didn't see me. That's good. Ooh, grab some stuff and then we'll go see about our friend. Okay, picking up a lot of food, which is taking space, but at least I can um, recycle it. And plus, if I have enough food, it's kind of better to take the food than waste a med kit if I can. Ooh. 
weird. Why did the phantom show up on my screen? Uh, let's take ammo. I would like to recycle that, but let me see how much space I have. I'm running out of space. I'll take it. Ooh. Then if I really run out of room. Okay, we got a broken turret somewhere. Ooh, okay. Let me see if I did this correctly. Oh, well, no. Bad. Okay. Oh. What? Oh, no. Okay, at least I didn't break anything. No broken bones. I gotta be careful because I did turn bone fracture on. Am I happy I did? Yeah. I like the extra concern I have over my well-being. Nice. Ah, stop shaking. Where you at, loser? Trying to get the drop on me, Jorgen, Jorgen. Whoop. I think that's the director of the lab. Hmm. I have the sense he admired you. Unfortunate. Oh. I mean, thank you, Jorgen. I, I admired you too, I'm sure. You probably were a great co-worker. Projects. Okay. Q-beam. Recycler charge. Ooh, what's the black box? I wish Jorgen was here to tell me. Looking glass, Artex propulsion, okay. Glue cannon, complete. I wanna know what the black box is. Sounds interesting, it sounds sketchy. All right, uh, space elevator. Okay, read that. Uh, my new reployer. Dr. Thorsten, I just wanted to write you personally and thank you for the new employer. I know some people have been waiting lists to get one of these and it was a pleasant surprise to find one in my office this morning. It is a feeling of gratitude that makes it awkward for me to trouble you further. However, if you could spare one of your engineers for a bit, it would be great if they could swing by and show me exactly what it does. Okay. Part requisition. Wanted to clear a Morgan request again. Morgan was down in hardware today, just standing there as if not sure where to go. And when I offered to help, Morgan asked for one of, for more operator parts. I asked if the last ones we'd send hadn't been sufficient and I got a blank look. I mean, no offense, but Morgan's requisitioned enough to repair any operator on the station five times over now. And we have other operators that need maintenance. Okay. I'm assuming this is for January, but how many versions of January did Morgan make? Why did you need that many parts? Beyond the Stars, unofficial trans star history. Dub the Ray's Field Theory. This discovery proved to be the jumping off point for a string of scientific miracles trans star began churning out less than a year later. Take, for example, the now ubiquitous operators, which take advantage of localized levitation effect derived from the theory's gravitational outworkings. Indeed, from the matter stripping field inter uh, interactions inside the bowels of the recyclers to the artificial gravity that keeps boots firmly planted on the Italian marble of Talos I, the impact of Dr. Reyes's theory is un Undeniable. Okay, Dr. Reyes, thank you so much. Ooh. Oh. Where'd I get this from? If you forgot the code, ESXE. I don't know chemistry. ESXE. You're, wait, can I hack this? No. Okay, you're a doctor. You have to have, okay, thank you for being a nerd. Let's see. I know nothing about the periodic table. Because literally everyone in my freshman year chem class cheated. And the professor knew about it, so don't get upset because I said that. Ooh, okay, 54. Uh, do, 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 do. I'm probably looking right at it. I'm 
blind and easily distracted. This isn't fair. Oh, wait. 99. 54. Let's go. Oh, no, no, no. Ooh, thank you. Ooh, what's this? A dangerous prototype device that attracts all objects within a short radius and recycles them. Can be thrown or attached to surfaces. Can I use it as a weapon? Hold up. Um, let's just take food. Yeah. When detonated, the recycler charge breaks down the molecule structure of nearby objects into recyclable material. Uniform offers some degree of protection, but it's not a failsafe. Standing too close can prove hazardous. Can I use it to recycle a phantom? Ooh, did you walk past me? Where are you? I'm gonna get you. Soon as I find you. Where'd you go? Oh. You never know. Alright, you might have walked right past me, honestly. I'll go back upstairs and check. I want to be upstairs anyway. Obviously didn't come this way because I don't think they can unlock doors. Did you come in here? Hi! No, no, stop it. Stop running. Stop running. Accept your fate. Okay. Um, let's... Ooh, okay. Let's glue the phantom and then try to recycle the phantom. Where are you at? Hi, phantom! Okay. Recycle. I like recycle charges. Okay, give me your materials. Oh my god, that's so much fun. Okay, I'm gonna save these puppies for a rainy day. But like, I kind of love it. Okay, I wish I could find another recycler. I probably should have fixed the other one. Ooh, synthetic materials. Take that. Oh, hi! Stop waving at me, it's weird. I don't, oh, thank you for re, yeah. Thank you for doing that. Keep trying, I don't know what it's trying to do. Is it trying to mimic a person by waving or is it trying to be my friend? I don't like it. There's another phantom somewhere. Thaddeus, keep an eye on Franklin. The man spends too much time on personal projects and recreational pursuits. We're all human here, I get it, but I'm worried he may try the propulsion system to access unauthorized areas. Can I do that? Did you lose this? Hey, this is Gus down in Cargo Bay. I found something curious on an outboard container on my shift. I think it's a fabricator plan for an autonomous turret. It was stationed, it was stashed with a bunch of old capacitor cells slated for delivery to the Pythias facility. It might have been an accident, I don't know. One of the officers put it in the safe in Life Support Security Station. If you want it back, talk to them. Life Support Security Station, I'll have to check that out. Dr. Calvino isn't feeling well enough to present the latest looking glass tech on our, for our visitors, so I'll be away from the labs for an extended period. I've left everything in working order while I'm out, just in case I'm sending you the key code to my office. Oh, I've already broken into your office. I just broke into it from a different way. Ooh, I can fix the turret. Station, I get it. You're falling apart. Stop being so dramatic. Keeping an eye out for that phantom, because it's here somewhere. I can hear it. Feed this engine op uh, engineer operator after... Wait. 
Feed this to an operator after you memorize it. Group workstation password. Stop writing your passwords on things. It's bad. But I'll take it. To whoever gave dear Mr. Gluey McGlueface arms, aka first shift, I bow down to thee. At first, I thought the jellied eel hat could not be topped. I stand corrected. Your triumphant creation of baseball glove hands cannot be equaled. Sincerely, the unworthy second shift. What is gluey McGlue face? This is a reminder that if you need supplies from the machine shop, the supply closet code is 1185. If you take anything, please let me know, Clive. Okay, Clive, I'll let you know. Specimen, adhesion test. Okay, dimension shall be optimized. Clean stainless steel sheet metal plate. Thoroughly coated specimen on sheet metal plate successfully. Media transfer specimen to conditioning environment. Successful, recommend moving to scale. Glue is still, okay. Okay, what? What is, th is this gluey McGlue face? Look at him, he's perfect! I'm not even gonna touch it. I'm not taking any of the materials. Hello, my name is Mr. Gluey McGlueface. Aww. I love you, Gluey. Look at him, he has a little banana smile. And I think that's the cigar as a nose. And I'm not sure what the eyeballs are. I love it. I think this is perfect. Okay, Gluey, you made my day a lot better. Stay away from the aliens, though. They might not appreciate you the way I do. Um, I'm gonna fix... Ooh, yeah, let's fix it. I'll fix it. Okay. I hear you, but I don't see you. A lot of the station tech starts here. Lab equipment, special parts requests, prototypes. We should be able to fix your looking glass terminal from Dr. Calvino's workshop. Oh, hello. I heard it making hello? sounds. Hey, it's Langley. Are you a... Uh, is there anything weird going on over there? No, like what? I don't want you to panic. What is going on, Langley? Not sure yet. Security is running all over the place. So, everyone's still working there? I guess, I don't know. I've been in the lab all day, hang on. I'm looking oh, now. Go? I don't... What was that? Oh my god, I think we just lost two laps. What? I have to go. Okay, yeah, you just stand there, will you? Yeah, I think he's stuck. Haha. -ha. Loser. Dumb alien got stuck. Ooh. Well, that's fun. Oh, this is what you were trying to do. Uh, we don't want a banana. Ooh, an experimental device developed in Psychotronics Lab, which discharges a psi nullifying pulse when detonated. I'm finding so many fun things. Um. Okay. Developed in psychotronics, the null wave transmitter means to burst the signals which suppress psychonic or psionic abilities of anyone caught in the blast for a short period. Does that include phantoms? Or is this like for people with psychic abilities that might hate me for some reason? What's this? By working through a series of practical experiments, this humble manual will introduce you to the fundamentals of modern analog and digital electronics. To invent, you need a good imagination and a pile of junk. And not wrong. Not wrong. Okay, let's look around. Ballistics. Um, oh, no. that, that was bad. Got it. Ballistics lab. Recycler charge. Are there recycler charges in here? I want them. Oh, dang it, ship. Stop being weird. Ooh, I can get into ballistics. Nice. Let me in. Oh. Trap 
fuck you guys? Oh, I guess sucks to suck. I mean, have fun. You're fine. Just stay in there for a minute. I'll get you out so I can kill you and take your stuff later. Ooh. Oh, I can move this. Sweet. Uh, I, I, where did I put it? Oh, I was like, okay, it's right there. I want all this stuff. For Lily, new code is 0198. Okay, code to what? Ballistic safe. You guys have a lot of material just lying around. Found the safe. Oh, one, nine, eight. Ship, shut up. Or station. Ooh, got some materials. Oh, recycle boxes and crates. What happens if I just throw a recycle charge into the room? I'll have to test that. Lily, I was testing recycler charge and something peculiar happened. I placed a usual source material into the chamber and set off the charge. Mixed in with the result was something I'd never seen before. A purple, almost organic looking substance. Maybe something contaminated the source material. I'm unsure how to proceed. So I placed the unidentified material in the safe for now. Ooh, I'm guessing accidentally recycled a mimic. Been informed you are in need of an updated recycler charge fabrication plan. Just so happens I have a spare plan in my quarters. Remind me before the next shift and I'll bring it. Dr. Thorstein, I'm finding your quarters. I need all the recycler charges. All of them. Ooh, I see something under here. Ooh, nice. Okay, don't know how that got down there. Will you guys be quiet? Not that, not that serious. Date of incident, employee Lily Morris. Recycler charge went off with my foot in range. The organic material that was once part of me is now neatly compacted into the sphere you see before you. Take heed. I mean, I'll take it. Okay. Learning moment. Ooh, these are mine. Ballistics chamber. Chamber sealed. Recycler AMP charge. And green. Ooh. Open chamber. Release Recycler. Oh! Ha! Ah. Okay. That's fun. I like Recycler charges. Give me all your belongings. Okay. If that's what that does... We're not gonna waste all of them by doing this, but I just want to uh, get some stuff. Oh no, I threw it too far. It's fine. Yep. Okay. I love this. Ooh, this is a good place to throw one. Nice! Give me the stuff. Okay. I could throw one more. You know what? Let's do this. Let's... Can I move all this stuff? I'll throw it in the corner. In the corner. It all goes. I probably could stop, like, chucking it. And just drop it like a normal person. Oh, wait. Okay, everything in the corner. Then I will recycle all of you. You will be made good use of. Just think of right now, you are inanimate objects with no use, but I am giving you use by recycling. I am so good to space. I recycle. You should always recycle. Honestly, if I had a recycler mod, I would probably kill myself on accident, but I would be so good at recycling in real life because I would just throw these at everything, <laughs> that you know what? Bad plan. Never give me something like this. I will either accidentally kill myself, or I will be retained by the government. Attained and restrained. That's how I came up with retained. I don't know why. 
Okay. Everything in the office goes in the pile. I need more stuff from my pile. Don't really care to put the canisters in there because I don't know if they will recycle or if they will just explode. Mm, don't know. Probably should test it. What else is here? Is this a hot plate? It's going over here. I can probably just chuck this one. Oh man, I'm so strong. I'm supposed to be doing things to like save the station or something and this is what I'm worried about. I'm worried about recycling. Okay. This is the last part of my pile. You get back in the pile. Yeah. What? Give me more stuff. Be recycled. Thank you. I now only have one recycler charge, but I will find Thorsten's office and I will make more. I could probably complete this whole game just with recycler charges. I shouldn't say that yet. Okay. Uh, there was another room upstairs. Hello, where do you go? Calvinos! Calvino probably has a key card. You can locate him, or what's left of him, with the security roster. Oh. Okay, I, I guess. I guess we have to locate Calvino. I can hear you. Ooh, someone tried to glue their way out. Thank you, Neuromod. Oh, hi, we brought- Oh, Clive! I think I got a message from you. Oh, oh, God, not directly. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Are you hiding? Sorry, Clive. I don't know if you were hiding or not, but uh, you had to go. Ooh, I passed right by one thing that I really have been wanting, a recycler. Okay. Let's put all the junk in here. Honestly, let's transfer some food. Get rid of this extra glue cannon. Um, okay, we'll leave that in there for right now while I look for more stuff. More wire, tubing, uh, glue canisters. What is this? Wrench wings have greater chance of knock back the opponent. I'll take it. What are scope chipsets? Chips not available. All right, I'll figure that out later. You know what, let's recycle this crossbow. All right. Oh, I was about to say, can I not open that? And get rid of the junk, get the recycle, and then we get all the stuff. Nice. Okay, I am out of shotgun bullets. What's this? Oh, it's just something with the brain. over there. Okay. Who are you? Take your glue cannon. Thaddeus! How you doing? Dr. Thorstein, where are you? Machine shop. I was just... I, I heard an explosion. Forget that. Grab whatever you can and get to my office. We're evacuating. What? 
What should I... Neuromods. Exotic material. Just hurry. Meet me in my office. Yes, sir. And bring a glue gun. Well, he got the glue gun, but he didn't quite make it to your office. Okay, let's chuck some more of this stuff. Goodbye to the extra glue cannon. And we don't need this extra pistol. That, okay. Back on track. Gotta get to Calvino's. Wait, we need his key card, so we need to find Calvino. Uh, let's head back upstairs. Wait, there's a crawl space over there, and there was also a crawl space over here. Oh, gotta move more stuff. Okay. Ooh, we got a turret. Would you like to come over here? I was gonna say, I don't think that's ranged. I don't think you're in range. Come here. Come here. Come be my friend. Okay. Um, uh, mimics. We're looking for things that are out of place because I know I saw something. We'll worry about the operator in a second. Oh, hello! Jesus! Oh, okay, suit integrity is compromised. Continue to lose oxygen until the suit is repaired. Oxygen can be replenished and O2 canister. Rude. Why do you have a flamethrower? Back off. Oh, wait. Very rude of you. Um, do I have... This is what I need. There must be something else wrong with me because I also have like a black vision around for some reason and I'm just now noticing that. I don't know why the screen it has like a ring around it. Is there something else wrong with me? Health is fine, suit integrity is fine. Um... Huh. It's so weird. It's like I have tunnel vision and it's making me super uncomfortable. Weird. Where did that mimic go? It'll show itself at some point. Okay, excerpt from engineer Clive. Oh, poor Clive. Preliminary test with increased spring consent. Wait, so proved pr promising. 
Uh, it's tricky getting fabricators to make this stiff enough for, but not brittle. Another option is scavenging cargo brought up from Earth. Thorstein's assistant has an eagle eye, though. Supplemental. Dear Clive's diary, he's just trying to impress Mary by coming up with an improvement on her toy design. Even if he was smart enough to improve her work, she'd never give him the time of day. I'm well on my way to figuring out how to increase the range and stay the hell out of my journal, Franklin. Oh, okay. Entry four number two is from Franklin. Poor Clive. Oh, jeez. Huntress is ready. Okay, guys, I think it's ready to go. I've dubbed it the Huntress Bolt Caster. You okay, buddy? Clive, I love your idea for capacitive tips for the bolts. Send me the tentacle spec and I'll incorporate it into the ammo fabrication plan. Those tips will activate any touchscreen they hit. I've gathered a lot of trash for feeding the fabricator so we can make some of those after work and try them out. Mary! Missing operator parts. Have you looked into the operator dispenser logs and missing parts? Every operator on the station needs to be accounted for. I'll bring it up with Alex next. Please do. It's not my responsibility. It's Morgan's Clive. Clive sounds like me. I'm sorry, but that just does not sound like it's in my capacity to perform right now. Thorsten, I check the neuromod stamps and the latencies in the fabricator and both check out. There's no obvious failure in the components. I may need to disassemble the machine. It's possible there's something in the specs Igwe is using that's causing the failure rate. Hard to believe, Igwe pretty thorough. Um, but we all make mistakes. I'll keep working on it. Maybe there was something specific about that batch. Weren't there some scrambled ones in the last cycle too, Clive? Thank you for the update. I'll handle it from here, Thorstein. Neuromod. Okay, so an issue with the neuromods. Okay, why are we freaking out? Conveyor controls. Oh! Okay. Oh! I dropped a dead one. Ah! Don't you wave. Did you guys break him? What is wrong with you both? It's not nice to break other people's stuff. I literally just fixed him. Aliens have no respect. Ooh, hold on. There was another enemy on my screen. Question is, where did it go? Ah, caught you. Where are you going? Where are you going, buddy? Yeah. Okay, um, can I get up there? Okay, why did I want to do that? For stuff. I could follow that piping system over there. I don't really know. Ooh. See another vent opening. Let's go up here. Oh. Uh, hold up. Oh. Why is that like that? Oh, radiation. That's why that's like that. Okay. What's over there, though? Alright, someone tried to glue it. Odd. Wonder why. Oh! Didn't even know I had this. A5. Oh. Wrong numbers. I was like, that wasn't there a second ago. 
don't think you can get the drop on me. Clive, we need to up the reload speed on the glue cannon. The actuators are slow on this, Mary. I feel like I can upgrade that. I can probably upgrade that. Because I kind of agree. Chip, you're not even freaking me out anymore. You're just getting on my nerves. Ooh. How do I get... Okay, that's leverage three. Uh... I really don't know if this will work on something that big. We're gonna try it anyway. I like recyclers. Best thing ever. Oh, I was gonna say. Are you going to explode or not? Okay, lots of broken operators in here. Ooh, weapon kit fabrication plan. Okay, so I can make upgrades now. Or maybe that's not what that means. It might be for repairing weapons. Which is still good. Junk, Psy Hypos. Another Neuro Mod. Oh. Ew, what are you? Typhon Lure. A Typhon Lure, aka Nightlight, emits a psycholuminescent signal that entices Typhon to move toward the lure for a short period of time, combined with other weapon tactics to escape, ambush, or observe the Typhon from a safe distance. I will combine with Recyclers. Okay. The Starbender Cycle Book 2, My Enemy's Enemy Enemy. Um, Mercy Flex Its Fingers, Having A, okay. Phase Pistol, Still Smoking. Um, okay, Fantasy Book, or Science Fiction Book. Is that all for in here? Okay. Now let's see. Uh, can I get up there? Oh. Climb, please. Thank you. Ooh. Take my stuff, please. Oh, sweet. And I also got a fabricator. Bolt caster. Oh, fabrication plans. Noise reduction on trigger action. Still a bit clanky for my taste. Decrease weight while retaining. Shut up. Uh, retaining structural ability. No more barrel splintering. Finalize the name. The hunter's bolt caster. Rejected Clive's suggestion. A pain thrower or Franklin's executioner. I'll take it. And bolt caster ammunition. Nice. Okay. Was that all that was on this computer, or was there mail? There was mail. Mary, I'm sure you might have noticed there's an issue with one of the tanks near the supply closet and it's now causing a bit of radiation. Please stay clear and spread the word until I get what I need to clean it up. Uh, Gary Snow here. I work in crew services. I heard some scuttle but about a new dark gun you guys are working up. Possibly something about assassin style game. Ooh, that would actually be really fun. Okay, ooh, lots of stuff. Um, propulsion system fabricator. Your Transtar uniform has been designed for your safety, comfort, and facilitate your work. Uniform must be worn at all times while aboard the station, while every effort has been made to take Talos to make Talos a comfortable and safe place to work, there is always the chance an accident or hazard. Departmental assignments can be determined by your uniform style and color. Okay. Bolt effectiveness. Hey Clive, sorry for the bolts all over the machine shop. It's really the only place I can try out the new gun. I think it's coming along nicely. Still want to help. I've already recruited Mary. Don't sweat it. Win the cats away and all. I think I have a few ideas. I'll draw something up and send it to you and Mary. Ooh, psychotronic satellite. 
A satellite presently in the repair bay of the machine shop is scheduled to be decommissioned. However, Dr. Kelstrip has requested that we remove the psychotronic transitor elements and install them in a new satellite. I don't know what they do, so don't bother asking. Just get it done ASAP. Ooh, psychotronic satellite. I want to know what that is. It sounds important. Can I make that? I think I can make that. Can totally make that. Okay. Calvino, security station. Probably should go to the security station to locate Calvino. Phew, excuse me. Function moon door. Ooh, what's a moon door? And how do I make it work? What's this? Ooh, it's something in there. Is this a satellite? Huh. I want whatever's in there. How does one obtain? What's this? Every airlock has a manual seal you'll have to disengage before you can spacewalk. While engineered as a safety measure, it's irrelevant when the enemy is already inside the station. If you do go out there, I wouldn't stray far. The Typhon may have spread to the exterior. And remember, other airlocks you find will have to be opened from the inside first. Last thing, you don't have a propulsion system for your suit yet. Oh, you'll need one to I maneuver. can make one. Do I want to go outside though? I also don't like the fact that there's the, oh, let me go behind here. I was thinking about that. I also, oh, don't like the fact that um, the Typhon might have spread to the outside. That's not fair. Kind of wish they wouldn't be able to do that. But then again, I thought the same thing about the aliens and alien isolation, but they were definitely outside that station too. Pick this up. We can make a propulsion system. Let's go. Uh, ooh, six neural mods. Let's go for gun upgrades. And then we'll hold on to the rest of the neural mods for now. Well, actually, hold up. What was that last one? Security. Combat focus. Enter a state of combat focus for 10 seconds, which slows down time. Ooh. I like the sound of that. Enemies take longer to detect you when you're sneaking or crawling. I also like that. Let's go combat focus. Okay. Combat focus enhances your overall abilities when active time slows down and actions cost less stamina. Higher levels, your combat damage will also increase. Combat focus can be equipped in the favorites wheel. I would like it. I'll take it. Yeah, propulsion system. All right, mom, I'm going into space. I'll go to the security system after. Yeah, I want to go outside. Probably gonna really regret it. Oh yeah, and I have to watch my oxygen too, don't I? At least I repaired the suit beforehand. But, uh, yeah, I gotta keep an eye on that oxygen. I really don't know how long I can go exploring outside. But well, we're about to find out. Microgravity detected. Your trans star suit is equipped with a propulsion system to navigate the harsh environment of space. Uh, to thrust, to boost... Okay. To break. Ascend and descend. Ooh. Okay, let's not do that. Nice. Okay, it says O2 is unlimited. So do I only have to worry about it if I break the suit? Because that's what it made it sound like. Ooh, human corpse. I want to see. Hello. I'm just gonna be taking a 
stuff. Oh, human corpse, oxygen refill station, airlock power plant, psychotronics locked, power plant also locked. Um, what's over here? Oh, let me write myself. What is this? Hull Breach Hardware Lab. Got any bodies in here? What's that one? Oxygen refill, oxygen refill, corpse. Ooh, also locked. Okay. Need to unlock some of these entry points and exit points. Okay. Let's try not to do anything that might damage this suit. Okay, we got stuff in here. Taking it. That's an O2 bottle. Don't need that. Put it down. Oh! Calvino! Hello. Um, apologies. You found him. Not surprising. Well done. Mio, this is Dr. Calvino. What's up? I'm feeling ill. I'm not myself today. I think I won't be in for my shift at all. Okay. Do you still want me to finish this array? I fabricated a shit ton of glass. Array? I don't recall. You asked me to set up a new array. You must have misunderstood. Uh, are you... <laughs> Honestly, I prefer if you left my experiments alone in my absence. Uh, well, look... I have a message you left me. Seriously, I would not have made all of this if you hadn't... No, no, of course. I, uh, I remember now. Let's just, for the time being, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't matter? Uh, let's talk about it tomorrow. Yeah, because the psychologist said that Calvino have been having memory problems. Is this another Will new you? one? Uh, this is, um, this is Dr. Calvino. Ah. Well, I suppose you've turned in, uh, or you're ignoring me. Uh, I just want to... Well, I, I will be a, a little late for my shift tomorrow, but um, uh, the, the first thing in the morning, I want you to put together a new micro-lens array. You see, the, the old one is its garbage. And uh, get what you need from the machine shop. And if Clive is being an ass, just take it from the supply closet when he's not looking. Okay. Uh, we're not supposed to know the code, but, uh, well, uh, I'm sending it to you anyway. All right, I'm gonna have to up my hacking in order to get into that safe. I think it's scientist, isn't it? No, yes it is, yes it is, I'm just blind. Yeah, okay, hacking three would require ten neuromods, so we're gonna have to leave that alone for now. And there's not really much I can do outside besides look for dead bodies. Because I cannot get into other parts of the station right now. Apparently I have to go to those places in the station and unlock the way out. So, let's head back in. We can get into Calvino's office now. Um, guess we just go turn on the looking glass or find a way to work around Alex turning it off. I really wish I could find fabrication plans for shotgun shells. Because that would make my life so much easier. But, uh, we'll get around to it. Okay, Calvino's office. Uh, I don't want to get zapped. Ah. Oh, where? Are you coming down? I'm gonna zap ya. Um. Oh wow. Well. Okay, hold up. Bad phantom. buttons. 
Oh, sweet. Okay. I can lock doors. Behind me. Okay, looking glass console. Needs power. Oh! Oh, what are you? Oh, what is that? Okay, so the R on the outside. In like a new form. I don't like it. And I wanted to go exploring out there. Uh, not the lamp. All right, Calvino, where'd you, wait, where'd your power button? Okay, caught that. I was like, what is in this office? Control systems, there's a metaphor here you know. Typically, the objective to control theory is to monitor the output of a system and compare it to with the desired output, the reference signal. The difference between the actual and the desired outputs, the error signal, is applied as feedback in the input of the system to bring the actual output close to the reference. Good control systems and good engineers learn from the past. All right, true. Let me pick that up. Mary, this is Dr. Calvino. I require you to fabricate a travel mug that weighs exactly 170 grams, empty of course. My feeble hands need something lightweight container for my coffee. I'll be sure to put in a good word with Dr. Thorstein for your assistance. Okay. Okay, I'll get right on it. Clive, this is Dr. Calvino. I need you to modify a scale so that it weighs 170 grams. Sends an on and off signal, please let me know when it's ready. Uh, sure. Okay. So you have an exactly weighted mug for a weight. All right, Calvino, what are you hiding? I uh, had a look at the specs you sent me. I see a few problems. I didn't realize you offloaded so much of the process and storage. What if someone took a wrench to the main server? The whole system goes down. Anyway, come by when you get a chance and we'll go over the details. I have a few suggestions if you're amenable. Okie dokie. Alright, let's follow this. Ah. Power. Also, hold up. Calvino's got secrets. We need... That's... A... Does this happen to weigh 170 grams? Okay. You wanted an exactly weighted mug, but to do what with? Is that a weight or is that a hot pan? It's a weight. You were hiding neuromods, Calvino. Okay, I got his cabin key. All right, video playback, select a video to send, looking glass display, could not connect to host. Uh, diagnostics? Uh, diagnose screens. All screens intact. Network. Server 1496 is disconnected. Network, okay. Oh, 1496. Restoring connection. Let's go. Nice. Nice work, Morgan. The looking glass screens are online again. Head back to your office as soon as you can. It's important you hear the rest of your message. Okay. I'll meet you there. Look at this. Ooh. It's running? Light field capture looks a little hot. Where's the photometer? The handheld. D did you take it? No. Ah, yesterday we had two, now I can't find one. We've only ever had one. Nonsense. Uh -oh. I guess you forgot. Nope, he's seeing things. He do be seeing some stuff. You're leaving? Uh, I thought we were done. No, just, just turn it off then. I feel like you're upset with me. No, I, uh, I suppose it's, it's late after all. Uh, go, go, uh, sleep. What about you? What about me? Yeah, don't concern yourself. I'll finish. 
Right. I guess I'll see you later then. Yeah, you guess. What? You guess? You're always saying, I guess. That worked, I guess. I'll see you later, I guess. You're a scientist. Stop guessing. Oh. No. Or be quiet. Yeah, that's Someone's all. in a really Good bad night, mood. Dr. Calvino. <sighs> Get on, piscatole. <laughs> He's just in a really bad mood. Anything in the office is gonna move, or I'm just gonna stare at this old man. Oh, I love that I can see different angles if I move. Oh. Do you see something? Ah! Okay, so it's showing you what you can do. Oh, I have an entire view! Oh, you still had liquid in there. Did you have something else in there? Okay. Excuse you. All right. We have ransacked Calvino's office. I want to check the upper floor one more time just to make sure I've looked everywhere. And then we'll head out. aware. You were not aware of your surroundings, Mr. Mimic. It's what caused your death. Where does this go? Oh! Shouldn't have hopped. I saw the hop and I knew something wasn't right. Another way to get in here. Uh, anything. Ooh. Oh, I still have the propulsion system outside or inside. Cool. Kind of didn't expect that. Um. I kind of want to get up here, actually. Now that I see that I can go up higher. Oh, careful, careful. I don't think this will work because of how low this is, but yeah. Um. Oh! Okay. Careful. We almost had it. Um. Let's do one there. something. Uh, can I go up any further? Or is there a purpose to doing so? I feel tempted to, just to see. Okay. Oh, come on. I almost had that. Would you like to jump, Morgan? There you go. Okay. Um, I 
actually, you know what? Let's get rid of that. And let's put a new one. There. Oh. Probably a waste of time. Yeah, I think it actually was. Okay. Honestly, the gameplay kind of reminds me of like a scientific dishonored in some way. Because with this honored, you could really, if you notice something, like a way to get up higher or a way to do something differently, you should take it because you'd always find new materials. Oh, I see you. Oh, stop waving. Weird. I told you about this. I don't want to be your friend. Okay, more ammo fabrication. All right, we found plenty of bodies. Oh, except for Gregory. Where's Gregory? Oh, Gregory's over there. I don't think I've gone that way. Crew quarters. Ooh, Mary. She's alive in crew quarters. We're going to have to check that out. Hi, new friend. Okay. Oh, okay, they don't glue while lying down. Whoop, let's not get hit by that. Side. All right, what was over here? A little theater room. Okay, we saw this from the other side. Who are you? No, you're Sean. Sean, where's Gregory? Ah. Oh, hello. Dang it. Can't you see I'm looking for my friend Greg? Stupid mimic. because I think it marked Gregory on my map. I refuse to leave a body behind. I shouldn't say that because at some point I probably am not going to be looking for the bodies. Fred? Oh! Greg! See, this is what I'm talking about. This is very, like, Dishonored style. Greg, how'd you get up here, buddy? Find Gregory. Oh! Skeletal repair kit. That's wild. Okay. So did I find... Was that telling me that I found all the crew members in hardware? Uh, we've got a body in shuttle bay. Got a body in guts. Hardware. Who's this? Lane. Uh, can I get to it? From, no. Okay, let's go up. It's a good thing all the employees wear tracking bracelets. Oh! Wait. Ah! Uh, 
Okay, I can repair that from the outside. Lock this room off and be able to get into a different room. Hold up. Ooh, there's a strong chance that it might require repair three because I'm noticing a lot of level threes. Repair three, hack three. Oh, man. You know what? Let's check really quick. Maybe it'll... Maybe we'll be lucky and it will require repair two. I kind of doubt it, but there's no reason we shouldn't check. Ow! Okay. Talk about rude. Hold up. Now I gotta repair. Oh, I'm carrying two pistols that I do not need. Um, I think I need a weapon repair kit. Which one is that? That's upgrade kit, spare parts, this is a suit repair. Oh, okay, I repair from the menu. Nice. I can't believe you zapped me. Okay, let's see if repairing this thing does not lock off that door. That way we'll actually be able to get oxygen to that hallway and be able to look in there. Spa uh, rival announcements about their intent to launch the first satellite. Also, I want to know more about the Psychotronic satellite because it seems like it was kind of important. Otherwise, we probably wouldn't have gotten mail about it. So far, all the mail has been very important. Microgravity detected. Some more important than others, but it's like at least linked into the story in some way. Okay, let's try this. We want to head... Oh, wait, I might have overshot it. This way. Okay. Let me right myself. Oh, careful. Swoop in. Okay, this is it. Reach failsafe. Okay, please don't be three. Please do not be level three. It is not level three. Okay, let's go. Reach access. Access the beams and waves lab. That sounds fancy. That sounds very fancy. Let me in. All right. Probably when we head back through the main lobby, I might do some backtracking there as well. I do need to, um, I don't know if I'm going to go with repair or hacking next. Because both are probably important to go ahead and boost. That way we can fix things. Fix things, get into things. There are some rooms that we're going to just need key cards for. Like that one office in Trauma. Oh. Oh. Why are you different? Why aren't you phantom? Why are you different? Interesting. I was gonna throw a recycler. One minute, sir. Thank you for understanding. Oh! Why? Well, that's scary. Back off. Give me a second, sir, while I fix some things. Oh, wait. We want to upgrade to the max. Hold still. Okay, why were you different? I have a feeling I don't want to touch that, but I want the type in material. Oh, you're carrying a null wave on you. Oh, let's not get zapped again, because that was really annoying. I 
need to figure out how to learn more about these um, question mark enemies. See if we can't see the medical operator really quick. Hello, nice oh, to see hey. you. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical can handle. Thank I'll have you. you soon. All done. Don't... You're the best. Come on over here. EMP charges. Is it moving? It's moving. Oh, Lance. Lance. There's no longer Lance. Oh, what's that? Q-beam controls. Please ensure a suitable target is in range. Ooh, before commencing firing test. I want to do the firing test. Can I have that? Open door. Ooh. Also, can I shoot Lance from here? Where does this go? Might just be through. Oh no, what do you mean I don't have enough space? How much space do I need? Uh, probably I need to get rid of those two pistols. Okay, there is a recycling bin around here somewhere. Cancelled forever. Come on. Okay, uh, Matthias, that's the counselor. These mandatory sessions are worthless. My design was stolen. Someone else got the credit. It's fraudulent. I need restitution, not talk therapy. I'll handle it myself from here on out. Please do not confront Lane. Let's do it one more shot. How about 7.30 this evening sound? Yeah, don't confront Lane. Don't confront Lane. Is no one going to help me? I presented all the information needed to prove that Lane is trying to sabotage my career. His promotions are the result of my work. There's no accountability in this company as far as I can tell. I'll take this to Alex if I have to. Your previous 12 emails outlined your concerns well enough. Please come to my office this afternoon at 2 and we'll speak face to face. Okay. Hi, Lane. Okay, hold on. I could just drop one of these as opposed to trying to make material out of it. Ooh, thank you. Lane, I've got a surprise for you. Q-beam fires a concentrated beam of unstable particles that will eventually cause the target to explode. This sounds fun. Lane! L oh, Lane, did you lock the door? You loser. I'll get in there one way or another, Lane. Mr. Carpenter, we've received a- Oh! Lane! Lane! Oh, you lucky- Just wait, Lane. You just wait. You just hold on a second, Lane. I thought we were cool. I thought we had come to an understanding that you were going to die soon. And no, you had to go and do something that was incredibly rude and inconsiderate. You just wait, Lane. You just wait. The second I find a way to you, you're gonna become well acquainted with this Q-beam. Can I get rid of the door? And I can't read mail because Lane is being an asshole. I'll be back, Lane. I'll be back. 
soon as I find that key card, I'll be back. I won't forget about you, Lane. I need your tracking bracelet. Oh, I can try it on you. Not all is lost. Hi. Oh, okay. It takes a little bit to charge up, and it does make me vulnerable to whatever those attacks are. Oh, hi. Oh, that was my bad. That was my bad. I thought it was going to go for the psychic blast, and it did not. It's a cool weapon. I really enjoy it. It might be for something that is not one of these phantoms, though, or I just might need to up my health. Oh, crap. Okay. Uh, I need to get this back. Fire the Q-beam. Nice. Okay, we'll get this back. Which requires me dropping that pistol again. We will not have the last laugh lane. I'll be back. Oh, these are what I've been picking up this whole time from Operator Bots. I'll be back, Lane. I promise. That is a threat. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's really cool, but I do think it might be for, I don't know, if there's a slower enemy. I think I hear them talk because I hear like voices out of nowhere. Okay. If you have a good angle on them, it's great, but that's not always a guarantee. head out. I want to do some more looking around in the main lobby area and we do have I think the code to the volunteer area so we could backtrack there as well. I don't know. We'll look around the main office, go to our office, see where the story wants to take us next and then based off that I might run back to the volunteer quarters. That way I'm just covering my tracks and I'm seeing everything I need to see for the most part. Plus I need to recycle things. Has that blood splatter always been there? Ooh. Oh, crap, it's one of the new guys. Okay. Oh, help, damn it. If you do not, that's not what I wanted. Not at all. Oh, I'm screwed. No, you are. Okay. I need to make more med kits as soon as I get back to my office. Let's use this and then I'll make more when I get back in. There's got to be a way to learn more about these new guys. Doing good, turret. Oh, what's wrong with you? Stop it. Leave him alone. Don't touch my turret. Why were you spiky? Ah, 
Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, you lucky little bugger. He just tried to stand like a person. Wait, what? Okay. Let's get rid of some stuff. And then we need to include this extra pistol, this extra bolt caster. We'll take these materials and make a handful of more med kits. Uh, doo -doo -doo, we need this. Listen to our mail really quick. You're not going to like what I have to say next. You have to destroy Talos One. Oh. The research, the Typhon, nothing can survive, including you. I know how it sounds, but you've seen what those creatures can do. They're a part of you now. If even one cell gets back to Earth, we're lost. I'm sorry. I wish there was another way. January can walk you through activating the self-destruct mechanism. Alex will try to stop you. He's allergic to failure. Too proud to go back to mom and dad with his tail between his legs. So, it's up to you now. Good luck. Told you you wouldn't like it. Okay, so we have to destroy the station. I was thinking back to Calvino's looking glass. I saw that she was sitting in that room where we um, saw that first save. So I just wanted to see if possibly it was still on the wall and it was. No one had erased it when she made that tape. Okay, so we can definitely Hello, head back Morgan. that way. I'm January 2035. I'm an operator. There are many operators aboard Telos One, but none of them are like me. Morgan. Okay. Oh. I'm your plan B. My first task was to free you from the simulation. Second task was to make sure you saw your video. Those are done. Interesting. New directives are now available to me. The okay. self-destruct protocol for Talos One is activated by two arming keys. Your brother has the first. You had the second. Alex destroyed your arming key, but you hid a fabrication plan for a new one in deep storage. That's where you'll need to go next. We can okay. worry about getting Alex's key afterwards. The Typhon are spreading fast, Morgan. You'll be racing against them and your brother. This key card will grant you access to the main lift and all the labs. Okay, deep storage. Ooh, thank you. General Unfortunately, access. I wasn't able to fix the lift from here. There's another route through the psychotronics lab. Morgan. That lab is where the Typhon broke containment. Interesting. Please be careful. Okay. Topic. You asked me to provide you with more neuromods, which I've Ooh. done. Good luck, Morgan. This is just one. I you want more. Me to assist you. I have more instructions, but I can't ask. Oh, why did that open? Until you've recovered both arming keys. You instructed me to sabotage the test procedures if Alex ever failed to release you, or if the Typhon organisms escaped containment. Both happened. Also, I just realized that I don't think all subtitles are on. Uh, all dialogue. There we go. Sorry about that. Every neuromod takes a snapshot yeah, of your my brain bad. and models what it would look like if you learned something new. Then it makes those changes. Billions of connections remapped in a matter of minutes. Mm. All made possible by our friends from outer space. Oh, so the neuromods are completely based off Simmons the Titan. Simmons installed blank neuromods on you. That's why you can remember the previous day's test and escape. 
I have your voice. It's a tactic to ease your natural suspicion. I'm sure you realize this. Yeah. I mention it so that you'll know I'm earnest. I still don't trust you. I don't trust anybody. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm really happy I thought about Calvino's lab and how you can actually see... Okay, make more. You can actually see a full view if you change your, where you're standing. 5150 is the code for the very first safe that we saw. So that just shows me that it's good to start backtracking now. Man, I really wish I had more recyclers. Well, we know where the plans are. We need to find the crew quarters because we've been getting a- Attitude adjustment required. <laughs> Attitude adjustment. Oh, the creepy ones. No! What are you doing? It destroyed my my turret, and then it made another one. Oh, he, you little creeps. You freaks. Okay, we have a general access key, which does not work here. Dang it. Okay. I still broke your window, though. I'm trying to see what the chances are that maybe I could bounce a uh, huntress bolt but i really don't think it's possible i'm just gonna need to find a key card Ooh, hold up what the frick oh i thought it was one of the scary ones okay hold still Ugh. stop trying to stand on two legs it's weird what we can do Hello. good to see you again dr Hill. henrik devries okay henrik where is your body as more than likely that is going to be Talos One Lobby. Huh. What? More than likely his key is gonna be on his body. How did you get all the way up there? Hold up, okay. Let's see something. Checking for updates. Servers offline. Is there a purpose to going up that high? Okay. We're about to figure this out. I don't think I can... All right, I want an actual bridge. All right. We'll have to figure it out from there. Oh, I missed a part of my bridge. Okay. Are you in the ceiling? Oh, I probably... This is probably a terrible way to do this. It says he's in the lobby, but that doesn't really mean that he's here. Um... Oh, okay. Okay. I can stand on this. Huh. More than likely, what I'm trying to do is more closer related to getting the elevator working than how I'm trying to, like, force it. Okay, maybe I should be focused on getting the elevator working. Well, at least go this way. Okay, we've got... Sales division, maintenance, okay. We have been in here, because that's Yuri's office. All right, this is maintenance access. Oh, what's below me? Well, dang! You didn't even make... Where's the copy? You just happened to be something. I don't like that. Normally, you copy something nearby. Well, that was rude of you to switch up all of a sudden. Okay, I can just fix my suit this way. As opposed to trying to look for it. This is just 
the other side of the looking glass. Okay. Can I go up for any reason? Is there a purpose for it? Okay. I really think getting to Hendrick is going to be heavily reliant on getting the elevator working. Can I just like... So they do talk. Oh. Man, I really wish I had a recycler. Okay. Surprise attack. Oh, careful. I can go through glass. Oh, 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 because it hit the canister. Okay, I was standing too close to that canister. I'm gonna do that again and just move the canister. If I had a recycler mod, wouldn't even be worried. Oh, dang it, put me back here. Why does it keep trying to open the map? I don't want the map. I want... Get over here. Scanning target, no type of material detected. Okay, let's open this just in case we need to go this way for any reason. Not gonna get me twice. Oh, you know what? I could throw that down. Let's let's do something real quick. Wish we weren't alone in the universe. You're not, buddy. That's kind of the bad part. Oh, shh. Okay, so I can just drop those on them if I really wanted to, if I time it right. Good to know. Where you at? Ooh, let's not fall. Let's not fall. Would you like to hold this canister? Well, actually, I could just... No, don't go the other way. I'll... I want to give you a present. But it requires... You... Oh, now you want to go over to where I want you to be. Did you? And there you are. Stop moving. Stop it. Come back. Nightlight. Go play with the nightlight. Go play with the nightlight. Loser. Okay, where's the other one? I know you're here. Ooh, I have a lot more explosive canisters. I'm gonna get the drop on ya. As soon as I figure out where you are. Alright. Let's try a Typhon Lure over here. There you are. Okay. Go for the best with throwing this. Okay, that kind of sucked. Let's try again. Oh! You know what? Stupid game, stupid prizes. Okay. 
Did I nearly blow myself up twice? Yes, but we're not gonna talk about it. Ooh, IT security. Sweet. Okay, got more weapon upgrade kits. Really? No computer and IT security? Interesting. Uh, authorized personnel only. What do you mean I'm not authorized? I'm like a vice president or director or something. Clearance required beyond this point, okay. Uh, who works in IT? I'll find their body, and then I'll take their key card off their cold dead hands. Hold up, where does this go? I don't even know what you were pretending to be. Staff lounge. You guys suck at this. Losers. Okay. Where? Octavia, didn't you see the alert? We're supposed to muster. Listen, it's really sweet that you're worried about me, but we've had alerts before and I... We've got three more of these glorified vacuum cleaners to fix before my shift is over. Ugh. Make that four. Someone dropped off another. God, these things are junk. I don't think this is a drill, Octavia. I'm sending you the code. Please, come to the escape pods right now. <laughs> It was not a drill, Octavia. You're gonna wish you would listen. Alright. Let's see, anything here that looks <sighs> off. Uh, oh, where? From, oh, stop! Stop it, stop it. Stop moving. I don't even know where you were pretending to be. Where were you? Uh. Oh, nice one. Okay. A little bit rude of you. That's why you can't get out of the habit of hitting everything. Uh, something we know is Jesse constructed a chain of marble glass panels which soar gracefully ahead Talos 1 lobby. Yeah, I climbed on those. Also developed a Neuromod promotional image featuring the likeness of actors, actress, or actor Daisy Prince, whatever. Art inspires fires of creativity, makes us look beyond our present circumstances, what might be possible. Nice. Okay, who are you? Randolph. All right, that way's blocked off. I don't see anything above me. Uh, what's on the other side of IT? Human resources. Have I been in human resources? I, mm, I don't think so. Um, this would be easy if I had a recycler mod. I also need to be careful if I'm going to the ground floor. Okay, one of the weirder... There we go. Oh, I was gonna say, there's two of them. That's what you were focusing on. Okay, this one doesn't have psychic abilities. This one wants to get close to you. Oh, and it's very fast about it, too. 
Oh, you hoes. Both of you. Um, crap, I need to go. Go, need to go, need to go, 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 I need to go. Oh, crap. I knew it. Oh, get off the glue. level. Okay, it broke you. I'm sorry, buddy. Eradicator Autotroid version 0.7.6. It's here somewhere. Where is it? If I can get it from up here, I'd be fine. Oh, did it maybe go into trauma? Huh. I can hear it when I'm over there. It might have gone into this room. Scanning target, no type of material detected. Just looking up. Making sure there's no way to climb up there. All right, Typhon. Where'd you go? It's gotta be here somewhere. Cause it's broken turrets. Don't know if there's still two of them, though. Oh, where, where, where? There! Oh, it mul- dang it, it multiplies! I hate the what they do. It's like a little, I don't know, hide and seek. The moment you're out of range, they disappear again. Dang it, where did they go? And I also saw that one multiply right in front of me, so I don't know if there's three now. be here somewhere. Ah, interesting. You gotta be here. Don't know if they despawn when you get away from them. 
kind of annoying if they do. Okay, I want to head back towards the other lobby anyway, so let's just go this way. Also, is there another way to climb that I've been missing from, like, right here? Not necessarily. Yeah, I think if I really want to get to Hendrick, I'm just gonna have to, um... Get the elevator working. Yep, this is the way back to the main lobby. Let ourselves in. Hopefully no more of the multiplying guys, because they are really annoying. And I need to find a fabrication plan for shotgun shells, because that would make my life easy, make me very happy. And I need to get into the crew quarters and get the fabrication for a recycler, because that would also make my life easy. I would just be throwing recyclers at everything. I can hear you already. Okay, I could go back and fix the elevator, or I could just use the pathway I've already created. Oh, my suit is terrible. Oh, my health is terrible. Oops. Ooh, that's what I get for doing what I did. Do I really want to run all the way back to my office? I find it so interesting that some of them talk. Also, what's up there? Kind of want to know. It looks like floor? I mean, that glass looks like flooring. Leave me alone. I'm doing stuff. Doesn't involve you. Oh, wait. Uh, do I have the access code for the security room? Oh. Hi. Oh, sweet. I can just hack it. Ooh, hacking. Allows you to bypass security systems, protecting, okay, higher skill levels, you can hack robotic, okay, such so as turrets and operators. Alright. Okay, that's easy. Um, oh, annoying. What am I doing on neuromods? Ooh, okay, I got six. I could do the hacking, which I'm considering. There's also suit modification, uh, re increase recycling yield, that would be helpful. Increase the health. Oof. Kinda looking at this one. Natural lifespan increased by 75 years. All right, that took away my hacking, or my ability to possibly hack this. Just gonna, oh, sweet. Okay, upgrading health gave me health. Awesome. Okay. Wanna live inside us like a disease. Ah, I see you. What am I doing? I want this. Oh, hi. Please mind your business. Oh, okay. That was dumb. I kind of thought it was going to, like, hit that um, banister. Thought it was going to hit the banister. 
Nice. Okay. Barely made it. Ooh, can I break into fabrication? No. I need hacking for to get into fabrication. Wait a minute. There's also a vent over here that was closed up. I don't like you. Oh, nice one. Okay. Didn't expect you guys to be side by side. I respect it. Okay. Ooh, it requires leverage too. Dang it. What do I need for leverage too? Four. Okay. I still hear one. Just checking. Um, oh, I didn't even notice you don't have a name. V O ten two two five oh one. I wanna go that way. If I had a recycler. Okay. I find this interesting, but you know what? I'm gonna take advantage of it. Oh, come on. You were so close to moving. You know you want to. Okay. Maybe if I do it with this, something heavier. That's not fair. You went through it. Take your job seriously. Okay. The aliens aren't playing fair. Why is this cardboard box sturdier than that other box? No, okay. The game's like, you're not... Haha! <laughs> Screw you, game. I do things my way. I was about to say, the game's like, you're not... We're not gonna allow you to do this. Stop being stupid. Find the actual way around. It's like, no, you're not the boss of me. Okay. Interesting. Right, there's another way that way. Oh, this is where I was gonna try to climb up to. Whose dead body is this? Oh, is that not glass? That might not be glass. Yes, it is glass. Oh, I'll get it later. Just checking. I'll get it later. Junior Bookman. Okay, where does this other vent go? Oh, it's locked. That is not fair. Okay, but I mean, I found a dead body. Oh no. Oh, I was about to say, please tell me I just didn't get myself stuck in there. Well, I could just, you know, break the glass and crawl out. So I guess it wouldn't have been that bad. There was another one. Where'd it go? Um... It fell into the nether. Okay. Let's get back up. Could I have gotten... Ooh, I also couldn't get in this bathroom before. Can I move this? One of you's fake. Which one's it gonna be? distracted. Um, is it that door? 
This is testing. Oh, dang it. Need another neuro mod. I wonder if... Okay, let's see if testing and quarters are... Ooh, mm, hmm. I don't like it. Don't like it one bit. They've returned. Okay. I feel like I can take on the world. Disruptor gun fabrication. Uh, where's this go? made that barely. I hear you. Stop waving. Get eaten. Okay. Might be a fan. Okay, I think it's a hacked operator. Okay, chipset. Um, inventory? Yeah. Wrench swings have general chance. Okay. Greater chance to not. Wait, are these the same thing? It's like obsessed with getting in here. Oh, hello. I hate the voice. Process doesn't hurt at all. Brady Grace speaks happily, enthusiastically. Brandy. Her smile is radiant, her eyes bright. There's no hint of paraplexus eating at her nerve endings. Olympic medals lie on their glass casings, facing her like an audience. Yet, I still have my love of skating, but the skin, the skill felt trapped inside my head. The mods she creates, the neuro mods, allowed that skill to be shared with others. A gift. That's Dr. Yu doesn't want your report. Dr. Yu wants you to leave them alone. Is this a... Ooh. Okay. I assume this takes me out into that other room. Ooh. Okay, I might fix that. I want that stuff. Do I... Storage. Door actuators are wonky. Come see me if you need in. Graves. Uh, I could force it if I had leverage. I could force it. Okay, you know what? Uh, 
We're carrying around some junk, but we still have a little bit more room. Okay, we got bad operators. Oh, hold up. I saw something. What did I see? What did I see? Ooh, fabrication. What was that? Psychic abilities. That's kind of rude of you. Um, I have to fix this. Okay, it says it's not bad. Maybe it's just. Oh, shoot. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Give me my gun. Um Throw it. Do Morgan. Morgan, if you do not throw that. Okay. Okay. Get this. Crap. Why are all the guns automated? Throw it. Don't open, 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 open. Okay. All right, a giant robot. I don't really know what type of operator that is, but I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna kill it. I just gotta do it correctly this time. Oh, sweet, it started me off in here. Okay. All right. Let's get rid of the tiny operate. Wait, okay. Plans. Get rid of the operators. Focus on the big one. Okay. Oh! Loser. Freak me out. It did kind of catch me by surprise, but I won't even lie. Okay. That's one. That's two. One of those is the big one, another has to be another operator. big one. Okay. This thing is basically just a big ball of, like, psychic energy, right? Oh, okay. Where are you going? Ooh, I see a fabricator. I would like to get over there. If I can disable it for even a couple of seconds. I have a couple of shotgun rounds and the Q-beam. I 
I just have to get to where I can get to it. Okay, we're gonna see if we can see it when it passes this window. Then we'll, it, I don't think it's big enough to get through that door. So when that happens, we'll throw this at it. And we'll see if we cannot disable it. Why, while I'm doing this, one second. Power, that would be helpful. Firing time would also be helpful. I don't think I gave an upgrade to the pistol. Oh, okay. I can do two of the firepower upgrades. That's great. Okay, I still got plenty of this. Is it stuck? It might be stuck. It's not stuck. Okay. Oh, dang it. Now it's going the other way. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Come on. Oh, I think it... Oh, I actually think that it is stunned. No. Grab it, grab it, grab it. Pistol. Come on, come on, come on. We need more. Crap. Back online. Hold up, hold up. We can still make this work. We can still make this work. Come on, come on, die. Oh, okay. Big thing dead. Game, please save. Game, game. If I sit still long enough, it might take pity on me and just save. Typhon Ganglion. I don't even know what... Okay, I don't know what that means. Um, honestly, down, repair. We're friends now. Don't turn on me. Ooh, what's below me? I see a Neuromod! Ooh, did you drop this neural mod? Graves' office. Okay. Let me up here, because um, we need to make more med kits, not a disruptor. Okay. I don't know what that thing is, but it is stressful. make one more. I might hold off on doing that though. That way I still have more organic material. Okay. Let's go up. Alright. 
actually didn't want that, but I'll deploy it. Hold up. I didn't even know you were here, buddy. I'm gonna deploy you right here. Deploying. Read that. Synthetic materials. Read that. All right, back to the office. Scanning target. No type of material detected. Huh. Uh, oh, here too. Oh, wait. Oh, I need to go up the other way. Take the exotics. Okay, poetry. Please wait in progress. Revoking Neuromod Fabrication License. No. Give it. Unlock doors, fabrication doors, class. Oh, yeah, that's the room downstairs, right? Well then, where do you think it comes from? You're sitting on the station's largest store of it, and you haven't wondered what it is they have us injecting into our frontal lobes. You're brilliant, Graves, but you have the mind of an engineer. Good at answering questions, not good at asking them. Second guess the use never struck you until you saw the report from Psychotronics, did it? missing neuromods. We have four neuromods here in the test labs. We received four, signed for four, and here are four in our secure storage. If you're saying you ship seven, I advise you to take a look, to take it up with security and delivery personnel. This isn't the first time neuromods have gone missing somewhere between fabrication and testing. Ooh, hello. Mineral, synthetic, organ, exotic materials. Why? Running checks. Sim lab secure. Well, except for Igwe. But he'll be up all night. Speaking of up, did you see the photos of his daughter, Maya? That's not his daughter. It's his wife. Are you kidding me? No, she died. Well, when Igwe was younger, it's in his records. Christ, you've seen his records? Yeah. During the security checks, looking for those red flag sykes that the brass is up in arms about? Apparently, came home, found her dead on the floor. Aneurysm. Spend your life studying the brain. The brain takes its toll. Aww. With everything else going on at the time, with the shaming... Christ. You already said that, but I don't think he heard you. He's not looking at this station, that's for sure. Okay. Did I pick up another one? Alex, I figured it out. Just too late. Graves. Are you still in fabrication? The receptor molecules, the exotic neurotransmitters, we didn't synthesize them. And there's no terrestrial source. Graves, don't do anything drastic. You know me. You know I always have a contingency plan. We've been shoving it into our skulls. Yeah. It all comes from them. But you, you never... I'm going to send someone to help you. I need to get this out now. Oh, God, but... The neuromods, they can still be fabricated. Graves, do not touch the neuromod licenses. Do you hear me? Oh, you know what? If I found out that I was injecting alien material into my brain, mm, I'd probably be okay with it in some ways. Depends on what the benefits and consequences are. But I totally understand why Graves freaked out. Okay. I do wonder, though, have neuromods always been type in material? And is that why Transtar uh, has made such an amazing invention, is because it all comes from typins? Okay. So we've cleared out fabrication. Ooh, gotta make our way through the dark area, because I didn't finish looking in here. That's fine. 
Okay. Oh, I don't like that. Habitation pods. Could force open. My flashlight can go dead. That kind of sucks. Oh, I should have made more pistol ammo. Really should have made more pistol ammo. I'm heading back into fabrication. And you know what? While I'm in fabrication, I'm going to pick up a cute little turret and I'm going to bring it with me. I don't want to be lonely. And you can never be lonely if you have a turret. Oh, crap. I even forgot I opened this. Get those exotic materials. Typhon plasma. Used to fabricate neuromods. Hold up. Wait a minute. I'm going to drop this. Pick that up. Ooh, they get all the good stuff in here. Okay. Fabricator. We need pistol ammo, first of all. Okay, we still have three neuromods. Can we make a fourth? We definitely can. All right. With that underway, um, ooh, increase the effectiveness of med kits. I'm probably gonna wish I had done that. Bypass level twos. There's other things that are kind of more important than hacking, if I'm being completely honest. Because it seems like we can find ways to open things and find workarounds. It's a little bit more annoying because it's not as straightforward. Hmm. Increases stamina. That would be great, too. Okay, I'll hold off on just continuously making neuromods for a little bit. Oh! Oh yeah, I need to figure out how to get below me. What is below me? Huh. Where is this? something on the ground floor that I've missed? I guess we're just gonna find out because there is a neuromod down there. Operator dispenser. Okay, this corner loops. <clears throat> Be cool if I could just slide through there. Trying to see if I can see. Okay, there's a room down there as well. Ah, crap. Let's do this. 
Oh god, I'm getting sucked in. <laughs> okay, that was a bit close. That was a bit close. One of you is not right, but I didn't think it was you. I was gonna say something wasn't right. Right. Take that. I probably am going to need Typhon Tumors at some point, so I should probably also be trying to get that upgrade so that we can actually collect them. Okay. And see, th little things like that are the reason I'm not too um, worried about getting more hacking. Because if you focus on other things, you can find workarounds too, which I'm really enjoying. I do like the fact that there are different ways to get things done. I forgot I was in a contamination room for a second. Okay. Uh, we're gonna take this into crew quarters, and we're gonna set it up because it's dark in here. It is super duper dark in here. There might be something above me, too. I might have to check that out. Oh, yeah, I'm not a fan. Ready to scan. Debug build version 0.7.6. Verbose on. Where you at? Kurt, find it. Fine, I'll find it. Deck guys. Got a wrench in the sink. I'm gonna run into issues no matter what, so I might as well just face the music. Oh, what do you mean I can't have that? No, I just want to get rid of it. No, nope, go back. Okay. Uh, drop. Drop. Luca is no contrabandist. I don't know why he has the goods he has. I can show you where he keeps them, but fair is fair. You want the goods, you look the other way. Okay. More blackmail. there like eel stuff in here oh god it's dark just gonna chill out in one place while my uh flashlight gets back right oh wait i just i just dropped that pomegranate and moonshine that actually sounds good okay Saw you move, you little freak. Power controls. Oh, okay. Something was not right. Didn't know what it was, though. Are you okay? I think it jumped out of the game. Oh, you little loser. Oh, I think it jumped out of the game. Better not be talking crap about it, though. It might find its way back in.
Oh, it might have. Hold up. Odd. Okay. Okay, that's how the people in here died. They must have gotten electrocuted. Um, all right. Can I just, mm, that door is locked though, but maybe it was, um, maybe it needed power. Okay, we're about to find out. Sweet. Okay, I did just need power. That's still messed up. All right. All right, we've turned this on, so I guess we... Oh, hello. What the hell are you? Whatever you are, quit. Is it invisible? Oh, you little freak. Where are you? It's gotta be here. It's gotta be here, but where is it? I'm not gonna get comfortable until I know where it is. Did it go up? Wait, I think I see Typhon material. Yeah, okay, I killed it. Man, there's some things I need more information on. Okay. Can I get up there? It's my next question. Because it looks like there's something else back that way. Okay, don't climb. Don't listen to me. I might have to start from over here. Maybe. lead out into uh, the main room. Ooh, okay. We got crew. Um, a lot of people dead in psychotronics and in the exterior. Psychotronics alive. Ooh, interesting. What about this computer? Utilities. Unlock. Okay, that's volunteer quarters. Thanks for reaching out. I asked Chief Elazar and sent the team to do a quick once-over of the premises to ensure that you were absolutely safe during the next shift. Obviously, the safety of both our volunteers and our security staff is our number one priority. We unfortunately can't post any more security personnel to this location at the moment, but we're looking to expand our security staff and may be able to revisit this issue in the future. Let me know if you have any questions, Bianca. All right. Let's head over to the crew quarters. Oh, I unlocked it. No, this is testing. Hmm. I take back what I said. You know, having hacking too would be kind of nice right now. 
kind of sucks that there's not a workaround. I'm sure there is, I just haven't found it. Okay. Could head back into fabrication. Make three more neuromods. Get hacking too. And then this will be the last thing we do before we end the episode. And next episode we'll start heading through psychotronics. Okay, we're not going to be able to make more neuromods because I need organic material for that. Well, I might have some actually. I might be able to make some. Oh, I can't believe that took five. Okay, let's give it the food that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, transfer that. Transfer that. Okay, it will make one more. It'll make one more organic material. Oh! We do have enough for two. Alright. Now let's stab ourselves in the eyeball. get a bunch of food. I'm just going to try to keep it to recycle it all. That way we get more organic. Because being able to make neuromods is super helpful. And the only other thing that I really need that inquires organic is medkits. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. This is going to take forever, but let's just go around. Ba bam Okay. Oh, oh, no, 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 no! Oh, I was so close. Okay. Oh, okay. Dang you, system. How dare you shock me? Okay. This, we got this one, though. We got this one, though. Totally not worried. Totally not worried. Such a good hacker I am. Oh, hello. Hold still. I said hold still. Stop it. Oh, I'm gonna wish I had made more glue very soon. Oh, that's actually gonna suck. Here, Phantom. Where are you at, Mr. Phantom? dead it won't be over phantoms are so sad well i guess you know they are people oh oh interesting i thought that there was like a um a messed up electronic around get wrecked Oh, come on. Pistol. Okay, I thought there was a messed up um, electronics board around. But no, they can apparently control lightning. They can become conductors. I don't like it. Tired of all these Typhon. Um, 
Test one, two, three. Okay, we got percentages. I don't really know what we were testing for. Neuroscan. Patient not available. Procedure not available. Neuromat SKU not available. Um, surgical procedure. This procedure will extract the designated neuromod from the subject, returning the subject's memory to a period before the extraction. Debrief. May confuse upon awakening from the uh, regressive neurotonomy and could show erratic behavior. The following audio is to assist patients in understanding what has happened. Hello, volunteer. My name is Bianca Goodwin. I'm the volunteer and guest liaison aboard Talos One. I wanted to be the first person to congratulate you when you woke. On behalf of everyone at Transcar, well done and thank you. I'm sure you feel disoriented. Okay, that basically tells them nothing about what they just went through. Medical procedure known as regressive neurotomy. For the next few hours, you might have trouble with fine motor skills or recalling details. More importantly, your memory of the tests is completely gone. But don't worry. I want you to know your willing participation. Um, let's reload. Success. It's already yielding valuable information for our scientists and it engineers so please rest easy for now once you feel well enough i'll come by to conduct you okay anti-rad fabrication cool cool take that uh yeah let's get an operator save on a med kit Hello. You're Good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical kit can handle. Thank you. Your memory of the tests is completely gone. Okay. We haven't been this way. Found a dead person. How you doing? Joshua, thank you for having the Neuromod on you. Anything behind this? No. Just feeling unsafe, you know. You never know. Uh, due to the telltale spots. Okay. We've read that before. That's about the white noise issue. Alright. Um. Okay, where exactly are we? Oh yeah, how do we get in there? And then I have to... Did I not take these blue canisters when we first picked up the glue cannon? Ooh, skill recording. Okay, uh, crap. I can't get in there. Huh. Uh... Pass this. Okay, very easy this time. What are the utilities? Unlock skill recorder. Area map, yes please. Back out. Emails. We're locked in here. Graves has overridden the door locks and there's no way out of fabrication. We're in the research office upstairs. I'm with Snow and Devya. Graves, light is on. I can see him moving around in his office, but he's not responding. Yeah, Graves is dead. Graves is no more. Okay, there was a... Phantom in here when we first came by this area. Okay. 
Phantom has left. Very odd music is playing. Typhon lures. Thank you. I'm going to turn my back and it's going to be in here with me. Oh, get, get in there. Okay. Wash my back. Another decontamination exercise. What do you think they found? Just checking the corners. Making sure I can't go up any higher. All right. Back to the area where we first came in from. We'll open that safe and then we'll... Hi. Immediately take off to Psychotronics. Oh, nice one. Oh, didn't expect to see you there. You guys are getting better at this game. Was there anyone's computer I couldn't access before? Oh, the bolt caster. Uh, Igwe talk. I join you in the cafeteria, but Igwe's got a lecture scheduled. Here's hoping he gets right to the neuromod update so we can do a proper eval on the tech side. But you know Igwe, he'll go zener on us for an hour until we're all seeing circles and wave lines. You'd think he would have learned Earthside to stay focused. Tell me about it. I don't know what scares me more. The time Dr. Wiggly, Wiggy spends in the lab or when he takes the stage it's like listening to a metronome okay i wonder if i could also hack my way into that one guy's go see lane that's what i'm thinking about can i hack my way in to go see lane who's still locked in that one area Beat it up. Beat it up, Morgan. Beat it up. Is there anything up above this area that might be interesting to me? Oh. Don't you run. I see what you've done. Okay, I kind of like my... Really? You just had to talk. Oh, I kind of want to go up here. Uh, this is all glass, right? Yeah, okay. Um... Don't see anything of too much interest up here. So I might have just come up here for no reason. That's okay, though. Okay, we want to go down. Uh, is it that way? Might be this way. Ooh. Oh, no, it's one of the ones I don't like. Stop it. Stop it. Go play. Yeah. 
No. Get sucked in. Stop being annoying. Why'd you have to be annoying? I asked nicely. Stop multiplying. Where'd it go? Oh, come on, jackass. Where's the other one? Ow, shouldn't have done that. Eh, I won anyway. Wish I had caught them both in this, but I should have went at it from a different angle. Okay, it was 5150. Yes, it was. Okay. This is Hypo Fabrication, Exotics, and Mimic. Ooh, allows detection of Mimics and Greater Mimics. I want that. How do I use it? I'm tired of them getting the drop on me. Oh, is that one guy still in that? Oh, yeah. Oh, he's still in there. Well, you know what? You can be a chair for as long as you want to be a chair. I'm not here to judge you. If anything, you should probably be judging me. Okay. Uh, what's the best way to get out of here? Oh, up. Up, please. Thank you. Okay. Let's get back at least to the main lobby, and then we will, um, trying to think, was there anywhere else I didn't really get the chance to check? I'll go check on the lane situation later, because I really don't remember if we had to hack that area he was in, or if we needed a key card to get in there with him. Either way, lane's gonna die, it just might take a little while. Yeah, because Lane zapped me from I inside the door, and I think that's cheap. So I'm going to get Lane one way or another. Trying to think. Um, I don't think I've been into human resources, and I don't... Oh, is that from my chair? Yeah. I don't think I've been into human resources, but I kind of messed up by using my recycler. Um... I, I'm stuck here. Okay. Which, you know, is probably the game's way of telling me that we need to go ahead and end this recording session because it's been going on for a while. We did a lot of backtracking, even though we went into a new area, and I still have to backtrack again because we need to get into the office and trauma. I need to get into the waves and beams lab to kill Lance and get something else out of there. I think there was a computer in there, maybe two of them, that I wasn't able to get to. So we'll go take care of that when we come back. If this ends up taking me to a further save, and it might because apparently this save was 10 minutes ago. So I will um, run back through, grab all the materials that may have been left behind that I picked up during this recording. And when we meet back up, we'll be in the main lobby. And from there, I do believe we need to head into Psychotronics and, oh, hiccups. Need to go through psychotronics and then make our way down into deep storage where apparently we hid an arming key or a fabrication plan for an army key in order to blow up the station, which apparently that's Morgan's plan. And I, it's a, it's a good one. You know, the station is kind of infested with dangerous alien life forms, but I still have a lot of questions. So it's been confirmed that neuro mods are Typhon material and they might've always been Typhon material. So that begs the question, did Transtar find the Typhons and start experimenting on them immediately? How long? I assume they've been making neuro mods for what, five years now? Because neuro mods have been a thing since before Morgan went up in, into space, which is five years ago. Um, don't understand why Morgan allowed herself to be experimented on or why the experiments had to go back to back with Morgan's memory. I know why her memory had to be removed each time, but making the process so that it's basically Groundhog Day 
and she's reliving the same day over and over and they were testing something very specific i think they were testing the neuro mods they were giving her and they were probably um definitely type in neuro mods but for some reason uh this was the day that we failed or yesterday's test was the day that we failed january said it was because we were given blank neuro mods so i don't know exactly what they were looking for you know because it, from that one board we found in the very first episode, it looked like Morgan had passed the test multiple times in the past. And then that day that we get to join Morgan is the day that she actually, or they, whichever Morgan you choose, is the day that Morgan fails the test. So I don't know exactly what they were testing for. And I would really like to know because some days we passed, some days we failed. And I think I even saw a place on the board where one day we passed all the tests. So once again, don't know exactly what they were testing for. I would love the chance to talk to Alex. I don't have the most trust in January or old Morgan. Purely because a lot of the emails that we're getting, well, not a lot of them, but there have been some pointed emails that we found that said, hey, Morgan's acting a bit weird. Has Morgan been asking you about this? Morgan's memory has kind of been off. And it begs the question, what was going on at the time when Morgan had free reign of the station because there are accounts that Morgan's memory was not quite right before we started going in for the neuromod testing so I don't know if there used to be probably I feel like maybe old Morgan said this that there used to be a the way they used to run the test is that the neuromod would be in place, they'd run the test, they'd take the neuromod out, someone would catch Morgan up the speed, and they would probably take breaks in between the testing in order to like save Morgan's brain. So maybe that's what happened, but people definitely noticed some weird behavior in Morgan. And I would love to go back to trauma and maybe search around the psychologist's office a little bit better, because clearly on its board, it says that this psychologist had logs for four different people and we only have three of them. One of them was Morgan. So there is a log that is missing. I probably should be searching for that. Um, I probably should go to a computer. I do believe that was, was that Micah, Mikael, something? It started with an M. Uh, I probably should go to the, not community board, the employee tracking system and I should track that psychologist down because maybe for some reason they kept Morgan's session on them. So that would be really interesting. Once again, I would just love the chance to talk to Alex. So we really don't have much of an answer as to why Morgan agreed to this, what they were testing, and we still don't know much about the event that they call the evacuation. Once again, don't know if it's the evacuation of a city or if it was the evacuation of Earth in general. I assume Earth is fine if we're going through these efforts to destroy Talos 1 before any of the Typhon can get back to Earth. But it could also be a fact that there was an outbreak on Earth and what allowing the Typhon from Talos 1 to get to Earth could be much worse. So lots of questions. I'm thoroughly enjoying this game. I think it's really fun. I love that there are multiple ways to do things and you don't have to rely on one method. So I'm having a lot of fun and I'm really excited to get back into it. I hope you guys have enjoyed the episodes. I hope you join me again and I'll be seeing you guys very soon. Bye now.